I got a condo in Manhattan. Baby girl, what's happening? You and your ass invited. So go and get to clapping. Go pop a phone, pan, pop, pop a phone. Turn around and drop a phone, a pan, drop, drop a phone. I went to Beach House in Miami. Wake up with no jammies. Right, Miss Moth, I ain't gonna do long today. It's just gonna be like my intro. What do you think about Miss uh, Sheree sacrificing a uh, Porsche feelings for a good scene? No, the bone carrier. Yeah, she the, sh the she the shit starter. She is too much, team too much. And uh, I said. She always stirring in the pot. They finna get her ass with this incarcerated boo. Absolutely. Nene's going for her now. She going for her juggler now. Yeah. And uh, I, I don't like, I just don't like with Nene how she basically won't, when you my friend, you can't be nobody else's friend. Yeah. She's, uh, she's jealous of uh, Cynthia and uh, Kenya. She's jealous of their friendship. And do you think these remarks here and there? Yeah. That, uh, she pretends that it's okay for her to have other friends, but she doesn't. She doesn't really like it. No. And I, I when uh, Cynthia went out there and talked to Portia, and she told her, "Remember, she told him I should have been fired too. I forgot Nene did that." Yeah. She evil. She, she doesn't come out and say the word, which uh, last night she twisted that all the way around. She made it sound like Portia said that that uh, uh, Nene was uh, uh, suggested that she be fired. Yeah, well, it's basically, and it also is going to show that Portia got to be careful over that dish nation. Talk about these girls; they don't like that. Well, they get on the air and they talk about her. No, they don't. Don't know. No, she on the show daily, and she got to be careful. But she got to be careful. She creating a lot of enemies from that. Oh, uh, Portia. Because Candy also said, yeah, she get over there. She said, Portia. Nene also, I mean, Candy also said, yeah, she get over there on Dish Nation. And she get to talking about people. But Candy said she should just say, she just own it. Say, hey, yeah, I was over there talking about you. But you was talking about me. And just walking your word is what. Candy say she need to say instead of sitting up going who me? I didn't say none. I didn't do none. I think it's just all an attack game. Let's all attack Portia. No, it wasn't all let's all attack Portia. Everything Portia done had a fight with everybody. When you the common denominator and things, sometimes you gotta sit back and you gotta evaluate yourself. She kicked, she fought Cynthia. She she did. She she was wrong with Candy, even though she tried to play innocent. She shouldn't have been carrying on that uh, that rumor about that girl. And she should have just came to her and said, you know, is this true? Well, now she has apologized again. Yeah, but I think Candy just wanted that nationwide, that on TV apology. <laughs> And Candy needs to let it go. Candy, Candy ego is getting too big. Yeah. What makes her so special? She has to have a nationwide apology. Well, that's where, that's where she went wrong when she did it with Escape. Now she, now people getting to see her true colors. You think everybody's supposed to go on nationwide TV, nationwide radio, and apologize to your ass? Who do you think you are? Exactly. Exactly. And it's and I still say that Portia was a, a victim. Ah, that heifer ain't no damn victim in that mama. That girl wasn't no victim. And, well, that's my opinion. I know, but she wasn't no victim. She carried that room and then she jumped up to fight Candy when they was over there in the other, uh, and they was on that uh, trip. She jumped up, what Billy Bad wanted to fight Candy. But Candy was on that. 
But you, you, you're talking about a rumor, and you won't tell where it came from and whatever, whatnot, and you want to jump up and fight somebody. Fuck a loyalty. This is where people go wrong. Excuse my French. Right, but this is where people go wrong, being loyal to somebody, and you running around here being loyal to somebody, and all this time she was lying. She had no way of knowing that. She trusted her. Yeah, well. That was her friend. She trusted her too much. Yeah, she did. And I'm sorry. I think they both should have been let go at that point. But uh, back uh, to Nene. Nene basically was saying that she helped save Portia's job. I think that first, when Nene, when Portia hit Kenya with that thing, I think Nene went to bat for Portia, and I think that's why Nene is so upset with Portia. Well, then Nene shouldn't get on the air and make statements because she did that with Andy. Yeah, but uh, and uh, made that uh, statement. Yeah. And uh, she was wrong. Yeah. So, so uh, Portia clapped back. No, she ain't clapped back at she ain't clapping back at Nene like she clapped back at the rest of them. Yeah, and you know that she ended up starting after they left. She was standing there crying because you know what? She and she want people to feel sorry. Well, I'm sorry. I felt uh, at a hundred percent. I felt ten percent sorry for her last night. Oh my God! No, cause she done did so much wrong. She need to, just like with Kenya. She need to just say, hey, look, let, let's let this go. She never would apologize to Kenya, mama. You can't tell me this girl. She, she, she think her little shit don't stink. She never said, I'm sorry to Kenya. You don't think Kenya ever apologized to her? So sure. many I'm times I've seen Kenya out. try to work things out with her. Yes, she has. And also with Cynthia, she tried to make it seem like it was Cynthia fault for kicking her. She stood over her like Billy Badass. Come on now, you protected Portia now, thank you. Uh, now somebody gonna whoop her ass real good one day. And then she wanna sit there. Then she wanna sit there and try to get Kenya advice about being submissive. Yeah, you're right, cause it didn't get you no damn well, did it? I'm saying she was trying to give her advice. She basically is nearer than she thinks, and then they'll start working on Kenya and this marriage. No, I said she tried to give Kenya some advice about being submissive to her husband because Kenya was like, Oh, he like this, oh, he like that. Well, right now she's happy. Portia was sitting there basically. Trying to tell her, don't be so in, indirectly, don't be so submissive to your husband. You see where it got me. Well, it's a little late for that now. Um, um, we know that, Mama. Girl, please quit reading them blogs. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little late now. Ain't no, I don't think Kenya pregnant. I done seen her exercise a little bit too hard to be pregnant. I don't know, but uh, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to upload. I'm gonna have to upload this separate because I done made this. This is already nine minutes long. All right then. Yeah, let me click this off. I just wanted, you know, why? Oh, I might as well go a little bit longer. I just wanted to. Um, I just like the way I. Portia finally figured out. I need to get along with these girls if I want to keep my job. She ain't got nobody to take with. Oh, so you saying that they picked her foot up and kicked, somebody picked her foot up and kicked Cynthia. Somebody grabbed the scepter out of her hand and hit Kenya. Yeah, because she goes to apologize to them, they, they keep digging. But why? Okay, so you're trying to tell me it's okay. You, so you're basically trying to tell me it's okay for Portia to be, uh, to be violent? 
chasing the assistant she got mad at her assistant and start swinging on her i want her to swing on nene please do <laughs> oh, oh my god no because she's she 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 running around here like candy named her she running around here the street fighter i want her to street fight with nene i bet nene get that ass <laughs> i bet she didn't get there uh yeah and then she want to call her mama on the phone and cry. Oh, and that 50-year-old lady was talking to you like that. Now, heifer, your 40-year-old daughter is running around right here acting like she's uh, Mayweather. Nene took that and twisted it all the way around so it would accommodate her. Nene made good TV, but basically she just putting Portia ass. She airing her out. That's all. Yeah. If she want that check this season because ain't nobody filming with her. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. But ain't nobody filming with her. If you notice, they all walked out on her. But Cynthia went out as in, in uh, Well, no, Cynthia her. felt bad for her when they were on the trolley. Yeah. And, uh. Cynthia's a, a nice lady. Right. Like right. But I'm just saying, with Portia, Portia gonna have to learn to keep her hands to herself or she gonna end up in uh, some serious trouble. Cause somebody gonna sue her ass. She running around there talking about my money, my business, my, 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 my. She gonna hit the wrong person. They gonna go get them, they gonna go get Phaedra. Portia handles herself really, really well. She ain't had no choice. Ain't nobody fucking with her. Well, it, it, it doesn't matter. She did not show uh, aggressiveness. She ain't got no choice. She when they clap back she, she know her job is on the line. Trust me. She know that job. She know that job is on the line, honey. She done fought with too many. But uh, I'm just saying. And somebody gonna go over there and hire Phaedra <laughs> to come represent them. So they can sue her. Yeah, right. Ow. She gonna get fake. Somebody go go hire Phaedra. I like me some Phaedra too. Yeah, well, her little short fat ass is sitting over there. She's sitting her little short fat ass over there trying to figure out what she gonna do next. That's all right. She got two or three degrees. Yeah, but what good is it? What good is it if you can't use it? She the lawyer and, and ain't got no uh, clients. I think all that did was made her get more uh, clients. Yeah, right. Who she representing? You? <laughs> no, I haven't clapped back or killed anybody yet. Yeah, who she representing? <laughs> Bobby Brown still? But, but I don't think it has tarnished her at all. I think so. Her credibility is terrible. Know, they like the good, the bad, and the ugly. Oh, who? Why would you... Yeah. Well, most of them lawyers are liars, so she fit right into the criteria. <laughs> you see, they're going to eventually bring Phaedra back. Nah. They ain't nobody going to tape with her. You got to have somebody to tape with. That's how they get voted or cast off <laughs> the island. That's how they get let go. Basically, nobody wants to tape with them anymore. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. All right, then. I done made this real long. This going to have to be a video by itself. All right, Miss Martha. I had to let me uh, let you go. Oh, my. I think it clicked off. 